Fighting between Israel and Hamas continues to escalate this week. Just this morning, Israel launched an airstrike in response to a recent rocket attack by Hamas. I asked leaders in the local Muslim and Jewish communities to weigh in on this ongoing conflict. Tensions are running high in the Middle East, with Israel launching one of its biggest airstrikes on Lebanon and the Gaza Strip Friday in retaliation for Hamas pummeling the country with dozens of rockets. While the U.N. calls for restraint, local leaders pray for peace. Nora Gorenstein, CEO of the Jewish Federation of Western Massachusetts, sent 22 News the following statement that says, in part, We here in the United States, together with the people of Israel, also pray for peace and for an end to the conflict. Thank you to our community leadership of all faiths for recognizing our shared wish for peace and interfaith collaboration around the world, just as we have here in Massachusetts. This fighting coming during an important religious time for both communities. The Jews are celebrating Passover and the Muslim community is marking the holy month of Ramadan. The Islamic Society of Western Massachusetts filling up with worshipers today. The president of the center saying he notices more reasoning between religious groups here in the U.S. I'm hoping one day that um, people can just live in, in peace and harmony uh, and put down and put away whatever history or whatever situation um, that has kind of led us to the point that we're in because it's you know you can't fight violence with violence. People here locally decrying the situation. They're there's babies involved in this. They get killed. I don't care what your parents' religion is. No child deserves to be in that situation. And that's the best we can hope for is that they talk. Tensions similar to what we are seeing now spilled over into an 11-day war between Israel and Hamas leaders in 2021.